a first for the South African art industry. This original 1954 Picasso crayon sketch goes under the hammer next week. We know where the picture has been from when it left Picasso. It went from him to his gallery in Paris, then it went to a gallery in New York, then it was an auction twice in New York, then it came back to South Africa and uh, a local seller has put it on the market. The drawing was last sold in 2006 in New York for $240,000. For an artist like Picasso, his work slowly does increase in value um, and in collectability and desirability. Um, because after all, even though he was a very prolific artist, there are a finite number of his works available. Um, and it's, it's a major coup to be able to say that you own a Picasso, um, one of the absolute masters. But to the untrained eye, it looks like, well, a doodle. This is one of the drawings from his sketchbook. Um, and when you look at it, you go, seriously is that all it is but if you look at it a little bit with a bit more depth uh, this composition the two faces on either side look into the picture so that draws your it draws your eye into the picture uh, the man on the horse is the center of the this is kind of focal point there's depth there's perspective the horse is in front of the woman the woman's in front of the window there's everything about it that says it was drawn by a guy who knows how to draw um, and not necessarily by a 12 year old who's just having some fun with some crowns the auction is expected to attract international buyers who've in the past have forked out as much as $179 million to own a piece by one of history's most influential artists. Narissa Subramani, Johannesburg.